Mats Hummels and Jerome Boateng are Bayern Munich's first choice pairing in central defence. Strong, tall, quick and skillful, they are among the two best centre backs in world football. Bayern's classic 4-3-3 is built on creating overloads of players in the wide and half spaces. This means that Bayern need to push their fullbacks high up, so that the wide attackers can cut inside while the fullbacks overlap, and the wider central midfielders also drift into pockets of space from which they can support these attacks. The central midfield of the three, usually the rock-solid Javi Martinez, has a role in moving back to shield the defensive line, but there is also a huge amount of responsibility on Hummels and Boateng to cover across into the wide spaces, push forwards with the ball to carry it away from goal, and hit long passes into the wide areas, maintaining the high defensive line that allows Bayern to press. Bayern build their play from the back, and both centre-backs play their part in this. If they win back the ball, they look to switch it left or right, or use a deep-dropping midfielder such as Arturo Vidal or James Rodriguez to recycle possession. The passing switches between the midfielder and Hummels and Boateng, or out left and right, until the centre-backs have sufficient time and space to pick a pass vertically or into a gap out wide. By defending with a high line, both centre-backs can facilitate Bayern's transition to a counter-attack because by squeezing the space vertically, they are also closer to their attacking players. Should the opportunity present itself, they can also launch a counter immediately or feed the ball to a midfielder who is able to turn and run at a disorganised defence. Hummels and Bertang are also happy to intercept and carry the ball forwards, which adds an additional man to the attack. They're able to do this because Bayern are so organised that another player, usually Vidal or Martinez, will step back and fill in the gap. Of course, defenders have to defend. It's not simply about passing and creating chances. Both Hummels and Boateng are superb defenders, and this is down to three things. Positioning, communication and physical ability. As we've said, both defenders are tall, strong and quick, allowing them to recover should they get their positioning wrong or should Bayern be caught on the counter. They also work very well together. Playing against a lone frontman, both defenders are confident enough to fill the spaces either side of the attacker, watching how the play develops, rather than marking tightly and risk leaving gaps elsewhere or getting turned. As the play develops and gets closer, one defender will pick up the man while the other marks the space, but it's their decision-making about when to do this and their communication to ensure that one of them does that is so impressive. Hummels and Bertang also have the confidence to step out of the defensive line, even in tight spaces to close down a threat. Here we see Hummels alert to a danger, stepping out, and then joining the attack himself, while another player fills in behind. As well as scoring the most goals this season, Bayern have comfortably conceded the fewest. While the credit for this must go to the whole side, because Bayern's defensive model of pressing and compacting space relies on everyone doing their part, their central defenders have been exemplary. Both Hummels and Bertang contribute to locking down the central areas, covering in the wide spaces and turning defence into attack. They are the bedrock upon which Bayern's excellence is built. Hello, are you still there? Hello! Watch the best of the Bundesliga. Subscribe now. The official Bundesliga YouTube channel. Subscribe now. Oh,